This is Unit 1, Lesson 4, Constructing Medians, Altitudes, and Equilateral Triangles. We'll go through the vocabulary in this first video, so if you're good on the vocab, you can go on to the constructions. You should create a vocabulary card for each of the terms identified below. So, you need to know what a regular polygon is. That is a polygon that is equiangular and equilateral. Equiangular means equal angles. or congruent angles, and equilateral means equal sides, or congruent sides. So in a regular figure, all sides and angles are congruent. So the three-sided figure is an equilateral triangle, and again, all the angles do measure the same. We'll talk more about that figure in the next vocabulary term. The four-sided figure is the square, all four sides are congruent in a square, and we know that there are four right angles in a square. The Any figure after the equilateral and the square, we just call a regular, and then whatever the name of that polygon is for the number of sides. So a pentagon is five, a hexagon is six, heptagon is seven-sided, octagon is eight-sided, nonagon is nine-sided, and a decagon is a ten-sided polygon. All of them have congruent sides, and all of them have congruent angles in each figure. Again, that is the definition of what a regular polygon is. It has congruent angles and congruent sides, both equiangular and equilateral. So more specifically, which regular figure are we going to construct in this lesson? The equilateral triangle. A triangle with three congruent sides that is also equiangular. Right? All the angles in a triangle add to 180. So 180 divided by the three angles in order for them to be equal is 60 degrees per angle. We'll talk more about angles in the next unit. Our next term that you need to know, which is probably new, is a median. That is a segment drawn from the vertex of a polygon. We'll focus on triangles for now. Uh, to the midpoint of the opposite side. So here is our vertex. And here is our opposite side. And here's our midpoint, which we know is the middle point. Our last term that you'll create a vocabulary form uh, for is an altitude, which is a segment drawn from the vertex to perpendicular to the opposite side. So that's the key piece there, the perpendicular part. So here is our vertex. Here is our altitude that is perpendicular to the opposite side. Again, here's our vertex, here's our altitude, again perpendicular to the opposite side. And we have another image here. So you can draw an altitude for any figure, it doesn't have to just be a triangle, so I've put two triangles on here and an example using a uh, trapezoid. And that concludes our video on vocabulary.